Hi, Karen Morgan of Blackbird Bakery here. I'm here to show you how to make gluten-free just as good, if not better, than what came before. Today we're going to be making frosted spiced cupcakes. We've got cinnamon, cloves, and nutmeg that just make these things sing. Spice. Because this recipe is gluten-free, dairy-free, and has no eggs, we need to get our egg replacer started. So I'm going to add my one tablespoon to some warm water. You really want to activate your egg replacer completely before you add it to any of your other ingredients, otherwise it won't provide the lift that's necessary to give these cupcakes their shape. So once it starts foaming just like this, get your other ingredients together and then you're ready to go. What we want to do is add the canola oil with our sugar. So start whisking on low. Once the sugar looks like wet sand, you want to add your almond milk. The next thing that you want to add is your coconut yogurt. Now we add our baking soda and baking powder. Our egg replacer is nice and foamy, so we know that it's ready to go into the bowl. So in it goes. Mix to combine. Mix and roll. Good. Mix and roll. The main flour that we're using today is just regular white rice flour. And this goes. And then all our beautiful spices. Cloves, cinnamon, and ground nutmeg. The last thing that we're going to be adding today is guar gum. Guar gum is one of the things that helps provide structure in gluten-free baking. Can't forget the salt. Mix with a little whisk. Karen, I can help. Mix and roll. Right. Uh -oh. In go the dry ingredients. Mix to combine. Now our batter is ready for our cupcake pan. So these are going to go into a preheated oven at 350 degrees. Bake them for about 20 minutes. Now it's time to start the frosting so we can get these babies iced and serve them up. To start, we're gonna be using some vegan margarine. So into a, a nice big bowl, we put four big tablespoons, powdered sugar, a little bit of milk, and a quarter teaspoon of vanilla. So we start whisking all of our ingredients together, which is, I love doing this, it's just so much fun. All right, so it's ready to go. Look at that gorgeous icing, all caught in there. I mean, wouldn't you want to lick these beaters? I think so. The smell of the vanilla and the spices, it's just, I mean, I can't wait to try one of these. Just get a little pinch of freshly ground cinnamon. Spice. Gluten-free, dairy-free spiced cupcakes will make everybody in your house happy. Enjoy. Make some more.